More news coming in. Prime Minister Narendra Modi holding bilateral meeting with Laos Prime Minister. The Prime Minister Modi has in fact said that India has always supported ASEAN unity and centrality. ASEAN is also at the center of India's Indo-Pacific vision and quad cooperation. There are deep similarities between India's Indo-Pacific Oceans Initiative and ASEAN outlook on Indo-Pacific. A free, open, inclusive, prosperous and rule-based Indo-Pacific is important for the message for the peace and progress of the entire region. Peace, security and stability of South China Sea is in the interest of the entire Indo-Pacific region. That's a statement that has come in from Prime Minister Narendra Modi, who is at the part of the ASEAN summit in Laos. He's spoken about a range of issues, including terrorism. The stress is on India-ASEAN trade also that the Prime Minister has spoken about in the manner in which has, it has doubled in the last few years or so. He's announced a review of trade and goods agreement as well to harness greater economic potential of this particular partnership. The Prime Minister is in Laos and he is unveiling a 10-point plan to strengthen Indian-ASEAN relations. This is the ASEAN Summit 2024 that Prime Minister Modi is a part of representing the country. Prime Minister Modi underlines respect for each other's national integrity and sovereignty. It's a bilateral meeting also which was expected with the Prime Minister of Laos where the Prime Minister has spoken about a range of issues. The importance of peace and progress, he says, for the entire region. Peace, security and stability of the South China Sea, he says, is in the interest of the entire Indo-Pacific region. Prime Minister Modi holding bilateral meetings with the Prime Minister of Laos, where the Prime Minister is, where the ASEAN summit is being held right now. I'm going to go straight across to Shashank for more details on that story. Shashank, talk to us a little about this bilateral which is being held with the Prime Minister of Laos, Prime Minister Narendra Modi's counterpart there and the statement that the Prime Minister has made on ASEAN unity and centrality. Yeah, absolutely. So the Prime Minister is meeting with, the, uh, with his counterpart from Laos who is his host at the uh, ASEAN India Summit. He's also, of course, had meetings with the uh, Prime Ministers of Japan as well as the Prime Minister of uh, of New Zealand. This is really his opportunity uh, to meet with uh, senior leaders because, of course, this is the, uh, on the sidelines of the ASEAN India Summit. It is India's primary venue to meet with uh, India's uh, bilateral partners in Southeast Asia. Remember, this is the part of the world where India does over a hundred billion dollars in trade, where it has made uh, very, very important defense sales in uh, the last couple of years, an area of the world that because of the uh, shared rise, because the rise of China has posed a shared strategic challenge to both India and ASEAN. So, uh, and of course, there are shared priorities like Myanmar uh, that India has been talking about with ASEAN. So this is a great opportunity for him to meet with his uh, counterparts in a lot of these regional countries, which is what he's doing right now by meeting with the Prime Minister of Laos. And like I said, he's met with the Prime Ministers of Japan as well as New Zealand. But yes, he also made uh, a speech uh, today talking about the need for stability in uh, the Indo-Pacific, also talking about the need for more development between India and uh, uh, and ASEAN, as well as, of course, condemning expansionism in the region, calling for the for the end of conflicts like in Eurasia, as well as in West Asia. So really uh, making a strong pitch uh, for a closer relationship between India and ASEAN, given how much their relationship has changed over the last couple of decades.